there are different methods of the corrosion kinetics based on Evans diagram. Some methods of the corrosion kinetics based on Evans diagram are as follows. Anodically controlled corrosion kinetics. If polarization occurs mostly at anode, it is said that the corrosion kinetics is anodically controlled and hence the corrosion potential is very close to the equilibrium potential of the cathode. Here, intersecting point of the anodic and cathodic reactions corresponds to the corrosion current density as well as the corrosion potential. By estimating the corrosion current density the corrosion rate can be calculated in desired units by using Faraday's law. Examples of anodically controlled corrosion kinetics are, impure lead immersed in sulfuric acid, magnesium exposed to natural water, and iron immersed in a chromate solution, etc. Cathodically controlled corrosion kinetics. If polarization occurs mostly at cathode, it is said that the corrosion kinetics is cathodically controlled and hence the corrosion potential is very close to the equilibrium potential of the anode. Examples are iron immersed in natural water, and zinc corroding in sulfuric acid etc. The third type of method of the corrosion kinetics is mixed controlled in which, it is common for polarization to occur in same degree at both anodes and cathodes. Hence, the corrosion potential is almost same to the equilibrium potential of the both anode and cathode. Both anodic and cathodic reactions are the components of the mixed electrodes involved in the corrosion process. The next type of control method of corrosion kinetics is resistance controlled in which corrosion current is controlled by IR drops. A porous insulating coating covering a metal surface is an example of resistance controlled corrosion kinetics. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. See you.